Hi, this is Greg from Orange Tree Samples. In this video, I'm going to show you how the layer-based mapping system works in Evolution Electric Guitar Strawberry. Right now, I have a blank preset from the lead component loaded, and I'm going to show you how to create your own custom mapping. So right now, I'm on the default layer, which is the very first layer. And this layer basically shows the settings to use when no other layer is selected. Right now, the articulation for this layer is the soft sustain. And I'm going to show you how to create a, another velocity layer to trigger a different articulation. So I'm going to go back into mapping, and I'm going to go into layer 1. And I'm going to specify a velocity range of around 100 to the maximum velocity. And now I go back into performance and click once on the sustain knob. And now I can select a different articulation. But first, I need to make sure that it's enabled for this layer. So I'm going to make this loud velocity layer trigger the hard sustain articulation. Now when I play, if I play softly, I get the soft sustain articulation, but when I play loudly, I get the hard sustain. You can also change things like the release sample, pre-roll, or the velocity curve of each individual layer. In fact, any of the controls in the performance section can be affected by a layer, such as the fretting position, picking style, or even the way the pitch bend responds. You can also change the vibrato depth and speed, which is useful for certain articulations which tend to use different settings in this area. Some of the different conditions you can use, as well as being able to layer different conditions, are uh, a pitch range, velocity range of course, a controller range, a custom key switch, which is a non-latching key switch, the pitch wheel, the speed in which you play, and also you can introduce a random element. So using um, this layer-based mapping system, you can create uh, very specific mappings that will fit your project. Um, and there are also many mappings already included in the product. So hopefully that will give you a head start in uh, creating your own presets from scratch. And I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you.